Watch this video to forever stop fumbling over what's the opening lines of your blog post, email, social media post or even your sales page should be. People look at this snippet to decide whether they really want to open the email and read it. And this snippet to actually decide if they want to read the blog post. Even when reading a social media post, they would just read the opening lines to, uh, you know, to decide if they want to actually click on the read more button and read the whole content. We live in a world of snippets and sneak peeks. If people are not riveted by just a few opening lines of your content, then well, the game is over. So if you grab the attention by its proverbial horn, well, then you have won half the battle. The other half is actually won when you keep the attention. But in this video, I'm only going to discuss how do you actually grab the attention of your prospects. The number one technique to grab the attention of people is to follow an inverted pyramid pattern, which means give them the most important information that they resonate most with first. Make your opening lines so dramatic, so startling that people are hooked, they are riveted and they are forced to read more and more. Use these three steel-worthy ways to nail your opening. Way number one, start from where they are. This means that you're essentially telling them that you know where they are coming from and then you are pretty much on the same page. So if I were a productivity coach, I could say that you already know that making the most of your time is the key to success in business faster. Well, so this will have you hooked because, well, I'm telling you that you already know this and which means I'm going to move on to something that you don't. Way number two, start with their feelings. When you actually start with their feelings, you dig deeper, you connect with them at a deeper level and you really resonate with them. Well, this is empathy in action. So again, as a productivity coach, I would say struggling to make the most of your days, constantly find yourself distracted by your Facebook pings and Twitter notifications. You're not alone. So by saying this, I'm actually using my opening lines to connect with you and to actually start with your problem. And when I start by talking about your problem, you're automatically pulled in. You assume, since I'm so aware of what your actual problem is, I am going to get to your solution too. Way number three. Now this one is my favorite. Tell them what you want them to know. Scull the irrelevant details, cut the crap, get straight away to the point. If I were to don my productivity coach's hat again, I would say kick overwhelm to the curb, beat procrastination and get insanely productive now. Well, you will be pulled in. Why? Because that's a very credible promise. And when I start with a promise, when I really start with what, what the USP of my content is, well, you're automatically attracted to it because now you want to really find out how I will actually achieve that promise, how I will achieve that objective. Well, so those are my three steel worthy ways to grab their attention from the first line itself. Thank you so much for watching me. You can actually read the blog post for this video right here. And don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe button so that you and I, well, we can be friends forever. Thank you so much. This is me, Tablin, signing out.